What's up, what's up, what's up? Okay, so, so many of you had questions about my amazing blonde bob. You thought I cut my hair, you thought I dyed it, but nope, that's just the magic of Ray. So today, we are gonna show you all about the life of Bob. That's right, we're <laughs> gonna show you all the tips and tricks for wigs. Are you ready for this? Ray is here with me. He's gonna put it down, literally, on my head. Here we go. That's a belay. Just when you thought this was my actual poppin' hairstyle for this video. Right. Nope. All right, what's the first step? <laughs> Wait, are we waiting on me? Yeah. Oh, I thought she was, okay. So, <laughs> when you start this, you have to start with a foundation. That's right, and my foundation always is Put oil in your hair, people. So I really do wear wigs mainly to protect my hair yes. from too much heat styling, yeah. especially on shows like The Real. We get our hair done every, every day. single day. And that's a lot of heat on your hair. Different styles, different yeah. looks, color. Obviously, my bob here is blonder than I naturally am. Actually, being in the sun this summer has actually my, made my hair lighter. It's amazing. It's, you know, natural highlights. But, I really do want to protect my natural hair so that when I want to wear it out, it's not broken mm -hmm. and fried. So I like to protect my hair with Argan Oil. This is just one of my favorite ones. It's called U Oil by Unite. You guys have seen this in some of my other videos. And I literally will cover my whole head Drench in this. It. Drench my hair in it. And it protects my hair. It's like a leave-in treatment. FYI, all the products that we mentioned in this will be in the description below. So check it out afterwards. Okay, so argan oil in, we already did that. Yes. And then I had like a side part going on yes. already, so. So because she, her wig is a side part wig. Oh, that's why? We do a side part in her actual hair because again, this part is French lace. It so is a little- you can see through it. You can see through it. Got it, so you don't want it to be on like a lump of hair. You'll actually see through to my actual exactly. part. Most people use one of these things we like to call a protective cap. Mm -hmm. Or a wig cap, or a, or wig a stocking cap. cap. They have skin tone ones, oh, they yeah. have ones that are that are blonde. Think of the stockings you wear when you don't want people to know you have stockings on, like your skin tone stockings. Same concept for your head. Pretty much. Yeah. But we're using this, which is... No, no, we're not going to use one. Oh, we're not even going to use gonna one gonna at use all. We're not going to use one today. <laughs> because I love her foundation. Okay. <laughs> when I do an Here amazing foundation, I don't necessarily need it on her. Yeah. Most people use it to hold down the excess hair, mm -hmm. and because she doesn't really have any, we don't need it. I don't have excess hair? No, because I tucked it away in this nice little neat package in the back. Trying to act like I was bald. No, oh, she has so much hair, honestly. It, but I'm just really good at her. That's why we're trying to protect it with a wig. Here we go. Yes. So there are people who have like full-on wig collections. Yes and they will have like a room yes. that is kept at a certain temperature. Wigs are like a real thing, people. Like somebody really famous, let me know in the comments below if you know who it mm -hmm. is, had an entire room of wigs that were kept at a certain temperature to make sure that they stayed perfect. That they wow. Didn't. Yeah, it was intense. It's like, have you seen um, closets that have like a shoe room? Yes. And ra same concept, but it's all different types of wigs. How fly is that? Amazing. And we like to name our wigs. I think that is very important as yes. well. Become a character. It allows yes. you to switch up your look. A lot of people would think that like, oh, guys don't want you to like have fake hair. I completely disagree. Most men love the idea of like, some new Something new. Yeah. yeah, like trying different things. She is actually a he. We gave it a boy name. It was yes. just like the bob. The bob. There are so many different types of wigs. This one is a human hair wig. Synthetic wigs, you cannot typically put, put heat, heat on, on them. them. It will fry. You'll be right. like, Tss. it's like plastic. Yes, pretty much. It's yeah. plastic. Ver <laughs> it, it is plastic. Yes. So versus a human hair wig, mm -hmm. it'll last you a lot longer. Yes. It'll actually be able to curl with hot yeah. irons. You can color and it. And you can color it. You can cut it. It holds your cut better. Let's be honest, you do have to spend a bit more money on a human hair wig. Two or three. Versus hours. like a Halloween synthetic wig. Her whole That's why front it looks so real. is French lace. In the back, there's tracks. Because she has more hair, more natural hair, mm -hmm. I want it to match. So most times when you put tracks in the back, it, ma it makes matches it the fullness of, so you added more fullness yes. to this wig so yes. that it could match my natural yes. hair. There also are less expensive versions. Yeah, because I was about this. to be like, everybody can't have a $500 wig. That's doing too much. Okay. <laughs> if you see on, on my page, there's a few different uh, hairstyles I've done with a less expensive wig, but. Have you done it on me? Yes! The wig, she, you had the blue, um, it was the Emmys. Oh, I wore the baby, baby blue, blue dress, dress and the platinum wig. That was a cheaper wig. The wig actually costed, get this, $12. 
Ray put a $12 wig on my head? But you all didn't know you loved it and you liked that photo. It was a good photo. It was a whole look. I felt like a little fantasy character. Yep. And again, my husband was totally into my Looks modern day less. Marilyn moment. All right. So tell the people how we're about to put this on. Okay. Wait, did you color this wig? I did not. I had it colored. I outsourced. Okay. Um, Adrienne actually has an amazing colorist. Yes. At 901 Salon, Nikki Lee. Love her to death. She's amazing. They do a lot of the coloring of my hair, coloring of my wigs, coloring of my grays. <laughs> Just being honest, people. That's what this is. You don't have grace. Adrian, <laughs> if you are in your 30s and genetically you started going gray early, you are not alone, girl. It happens to the best of us. Embrace it. It's okay, Embrace people. it. Em no, don't embrace it. Diet. <laughs> Color it. All right, it's time to put, put on, on the on wig. wig. So, these pins are called T-pins. Oh, I didn't even know that. You're if you have um, a wig stand, most people get them along with the wig stand. So that they can hold you. Where do you get a place. wig stand? Is that something you can just go on Amazon and get? You can go on Amazon. You okay. can also go to your local beauty supply. Mm -hmm. They do have them there. They're about four to seven dollars. Oh, that's not, it? Not this one. This one is more of a professional one. So now what happens? So we slip off the wig. Okay. There are clips here. Mm hmm These are my side clips. Okay. And it is also extremely important for people that want to save their edges. Leave out mm -hmm. your edges mm -hmm. as he's done here. You see that all my yes. edges are out. So my natural hair is out because you also don't want this to snatch that out. Mm -hmm. I'd rather it snatch over here. Mm -hmm. And again, don't put it on too tight yes. or too rough because you don't want extra tension on your hair. You don't want sore spots. Ray is the most incredible at making sure that we can get every look that we want and we can achieve it and it can look absolutely fabulous. But at the end of the day, I don't want to be bald. Nope, we want hair. So I appreciate that. There's even times where I tell Ray, I want to go blonde or I want highlights. And what do you tell me? Nope, we want hair. Exactly. He says, no, that's ridiculous. We can achieve that exact same look by putting clip-ins or do a wig. Call but Bob. Exactly, call Bob, <laughs> protect your hair. All right. <clears throat> so we have clips here. Mm -hmm. These will hold onto the hair. This right here is the original tightening mechanism. Uh, like that yep. tightens. That's how you tighten it up. This tightens because everybody's head isn't the same size. And then you clip it down Together. here. Yep. Yeah. So this one is already, we've done this a million a times. Million this, times. One, so <laughs> this one knows my head very well. Right. And it's already kind of where it needs to be. To add extra security, mm -hmm. I added a... You added that? That I doesn't did. even, you sold that yourself? I did. You sure did. This is a latex piece that one. will hold the front of the wig down, mm -hmm. where this this little piece here will hold the back of the wig down. Because two things you do not want when you're putting your wig on. You don't want slippage mm -hmm. for it to start creeping on back on you and then yep. it gets weird. And the other thing you don't want is for it to be bulky in the back. You actually wanna make sure that you've got it down, strapped down as tight as possible so that it's laying as close to your scalp as possible. You don't want it to be like bulky in the back. Like you got extra brain. Just like you support those support this wig. Oh. There you go. There you go. That's an official. We need a T-shirt. Just like you support these, support your wig. Nice. Okay. I hold so that. I need you to hold this. Yep. Yeah. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. I hold this down at the back of my head. Yeah. Did you see that? Did you see that? Don't miss a moment. Mm -hmm. Clip. So Press the clips. It. When you put the clip on, you Press. snap it. Yep. You snap. Yep. Pull it tight. Mm -hmm. Guys, this also works as a slight facelift. <laughs> It like pulls my eyes up a little bit and I like that look. Boom. Now it did. There we go. Get her on first. Okay. Step now up. it's still up there. You it's see that? My whole back. back is her out. back is out. So we're going to cover her. Okay. Pull, pull it, it down. down. See how my eyes are lifting? Ooh, you see that? And it's actually like a good tension feeling. Okay. So now. Next step. We have her hair out. Remember we left out here. Look at it. It's all of a Blending. sudden now making the wig look like it's hers. Like, see that? We've got to blend that. Blend so you blend your real hair mm -hmm. with the wig hair in the front. I'm also a strange person. I like to tuck my ears mm -hmm. in my wigs. I hate it when, like, my ears are super out. We get to Like, for point. all intents and purposes, come on. Pretty awesome. We're, we're barely there yet. Like, we're not even there yet. That's just, like, the basics. Basics. Like, if she could do this by herself, she would totally not need me because I, I could style it for her and she could put it on herself. Mm -hmm. She's not there yet, but we're, we're, we're working, working on, on it. it. <laughs> we, we really are. Wait, that one time 
Okay, if you guys have ever seen my music video for um, Be Still with Israel, yes. I had worn that wig the whole day. I came home from work. I, I needed a break. <laughs> I took it off. I took a nap, and then Israel asked me if he wanted if I wanted to record the music video that day. My makeup was still holding on. I was like, sure, let me see if I can put my wig on myself. I put it on. If you watch the Be Still video, mm -hmm. I put that wig on. And I'm proud of her. Thank you. It was amazing. Okay, so now tell them the rest of the, tr the tricks about like... Okay. Okay, like right now I can tell you what's wrong. Tell me what's wrong. We can still slightly see... Yes. Right here. Yes. And so, I know you don't do it like that. To, to prevent that, once you get to this point is now where you start to, I would say, camouflage your wig. Mm -hmm. This is one of our favorite little things, the gem so, here. That, you can get this in your local drugstore. It's L'Oreal Root, Magic Root Cover up and we get these in all different colors too this yes. is actually the really dark one this is dark brown they have one also in medium, medium brown, brown that we normally use there's black there's blonde there's red there's every color any color you want gray they have gray yes for those of you who are going gray salt and pepper it's so cute That's they have awesome. that as well i use this for her root mm -hmm. it pretty much i'll show you what it does it blends you use this to create the root here i like to cover Now all of a sudden, that's camouflaged at this point. You see that? Now it looks like I have more baby hairs. Mm -hmm. And you don't really see the beginning of the wig anymore. Put your hand right here for me. One. Boom, right mm -hmm. there, yep. Now you secure the wig. It's I like, like secure these. the bag, secure the wig. I don't know if you can see that. Yeah, those are like open bobby pins. Open In bobby Spanish, pins. I think we call these <clears throat> orquídeas. So you take these pretty much and you secure your wig. You wanna find any spot in the wig where you feel you can stick this in and not, it not be seen. And you also don't necessarily wanna stick it in mm, just like that. You want to create. In and hook down. If, when you make this movement inside the wig, you know it's, it's secure. Yep. So find a spot where you feel like you want to secure, which is the temples and right here are your best spots, right? Cranium situation. In, mm -hmm. and then turn it around. Mm -hmm. Guys, that just took the wig from sitting off my head and it's now like, got sucked in. Go in, turn Boom. the pin around. Now I was holding on even tighter. Mm -hmm. I like to call this my concert method. Be like, who do, yes, I do a lot of girls This is not coming off my head. With a lot of hair. This is the key. It's a trick. <laughs> TV magic. So for Adrian, I only like to use four. She's not doing that much moving. She's usually yeah, we sitting mainly at, wear this on the at a table. She's usually sitting at a table, yeah. Talking. Having conversations. So. Ray tells me don't come <clears> out <throat> and act crazy. I walk out like this. This is, he's like. What What happened to your hair? Yeah, he feels you've like only I been, just you've wrecked only been my at work hair. For two minutes. I get excited. After you secure her, now it's time to style. We'll go beachy with little hive. Something cute, just stay tuned. Here we go. Remember that wave he attempted to show me in our other hair tutorial video that I failed at terribly? That was terrible. Uh, I don't know what I did to this one. In did the it just get smoky? It did a little bit. Yeah, he's pretty much doing that on my hair right now. Pretty much. It's and guess deep. what I'm gonna do? <clears throat> Sit here and let him do it. I'm not even gonna try. <laughs> this summer, I don't know if you guys know this, but I have strictly been on a no heat hairstyling moment and I've been rocking my waves, my curls, and just really trying to take good care of my hair, especially because during the summer we're not filming the reel. But I, I love the idea that even when we are filming the reel, I still have this as an option. And I feel like wigs have come such a long oh, way. Yeah. I love the fact that we were able to achieve this really cute bob that I wanted to do without chopping off my real <laughs> hair that I had worked so hard at getting long. There have been times <laughs> that we literally will plan an entire look, like the outfit goes with a short bomb bob, the makeup. So we did this look at the reel. Mm -hmm. Literally smoked my eyes out, the dress was bomb. I said, right, it was time to yep. put it on. Mm -hmm. Ray's like, okay, where's back? I'm like, oh, it's in my bag. Ray goes in there, he's like, hey, there's no wig in your bag. <laughs> I said, wait, what? No wig. Guys, I had literally forgotten my wig on my bathroom counter. It's five something in the morning. I'm calling Israel to wake him up. I'm like, babe, do you think you could bring my wig really quickly? He was like, I can, but 
it'll take me way longer to like shower, get dressed and leave or like try to bring it to you there. He's like, oh, you just dropped him the brush, okay. Uh, so instead, Lana ordered an Uber to pick up my wig from the house. Israel placed my wig in a Gucci purse. They literally ran my wig in. <laughs> the wig comes in, it's 10 minutes before the show starts. We're like, Ray, do you think you could? Ray, do you think you could put the wig on in 10 minutes? <laughs> well, guys, Bob didn't make it on time. <laughs> he didn't make it. He didn't make it. He didn't make it, and we got have... scared. Yeah. We thought we were gonna get stuck, like, and I went about out. to walk on camera. Ooh, looking crazy, I can't, I can't do it. I walked out so sad, <laughs> and that honestly was the first time that the whole audience knew Adrian's hair is not real. Like, yeah. that's not a real Bob. Like, that was a... So many comments were like, wait, that was a wig? Yep. And we're like, yeah, that's a wig. Yeah, it is. TV magic. Like, what come like come on, you guys. Like, he's a magician. I love that you have like a little travel one. Yes, of everything. A little travel version of everything. This one is Pantene air spray. If you know me, you know I do not like to travel heavy. No. Everything. Guys, Again, this is this his is whole all kit. I like. That's his whole kit. That's everything I don't want right there. Else. Why do we need the rest of that stuff? Wave, for wave spray. You always have this. Mm -hmm. Boom. Okay, so you guys, this is She's mom. a total new girl. This, it's not going anywhere. Ray, you really are the best. No, no you you're the best. No, you're the best. The greatest hair. Fine, I'll ever take it. This hair. My muse is easy. Look at this face. Let me know if you're gonna try out a wig. Go for it. Try it, have some fun, live a little. Let me know in the comments. And don't forget that in the description box will be a list of all the products that we used in this little tutorial moment. On that note. All things Adrian. That's right, don't forget to subscribe. <laughs>